Alright, hey guys, I just got another city update for you. Um, sorry I haven't made one in a long time. I really, um, um, haven't, well, I've done a lot to it, but I haven't had the time. And, um, I didn't know really when to do it because we've been moving all my Legos around and stuff. But probably the main change you notice is this road and how it's all differently laid out. What I did is I went to the Lego store, got a bunch of these 1x8 tiles and filled all that in. And then every spot where I had to do this, I just slid it over and I'm either going to put a sewer there or I'm just going to put some 1x2 black pieces. And I just had a bunch of these tiles and I still have a bunch of more. Uh, it's probably not even all of them, it might be all. Um, so I'm using that as sidewalk, it's kind of a darker tan, I didn't really have any gray pieces, I think it looks fine. Um, but yeah. And then here's my crosswalks and like the intersection. That's how they turned out. Um, I gotta get some pieces for that, so either from Lego.com or I'm just gonna wait till uh, the pick a brick gets some or something, I'm in no rush for that. I just got another base plate to go that way, and I'm gonna need a 8x16 plate to go up there because you can't fit two more base plates right there. But um, that's okay because then for that 32 by 32 plate, I already have it, but I'm going to be doing a how-to on how to do this Lego road. So I'm sure you guys want to know, even though I pretty much just explained it, but it's very, very simple. Um, it does fit a 6 wide, goes up to yeah, an 8 stud car length. So this fire engine is perfect for it. Um, so yeah, this is really all new to you. I just put this base plate in about not even a minute ago. And... Um, yeah, so this is uh, for a gas station I will be building. I got inspired from some people on YouTube. Um, so yeah, I got some markers going there, getting ready for like the drive-through part, or like the where you drive in and stuff. So yeah, um, here's my construction site. Uh, this is probably not where it's going to be. This is all kind of temporary right now, except for a few things. So yeah, let's go through a tour of the city. Um, right over here is my Lego kind of block, city block with the bank, pizza parlor, bike shop, and the city corner, or like the bus corner, bus stop. Then this road just kind of turns. I might curve it more, because it wouldn't make sense if it's leave it like that, I don't think. I did add a little little driveway, so it's flush with this road. The curb just go down a little bit. That's why I tried to get this the curb effect, by putting the 1x2s underneath them. So you can start a lot of these. And I like the black, because you can... You, sometimes you can see the pieces underneath these, but you can't in this, which is awesome. So that works out perfect. Kind of hides everything. Um, what I did with these, though, is for my fire station, because of this little lip thing. Sorry about that. Um, I put some, I think these are like 6 by 12s um, right here. So it's kind of like a parking lot. And then these are two. These two are just like in the ground now, like the other ones. I put my ambulance in that one, the fire engine in that one, because that my favorite Lego set is fire engine. Uh, so that's pretty much my favorite Lego set right now. Um, would not fit in this garage, otherwise that'd be in there right now too. Then my police station, is right across the street, and it's got the same indented uh, sidewalk too, which I really like that effect. Um, I got some ideas from my dad actually because uh, I didn't know exactly how I'd do it if I was just going to leave it level at the curb like this or down like that, and I didn't know if I was going to put black tiles there, but um, there's always sidewalk there, so I figured that looks fine too. And right here. I messed up because of this, I had to work around it, and I stopped right there, so I can't really put any tiles there, so I'll have to figure out something with that, um, so yeah, sooner or later. My marina actually broke when we were moving the Lego table, I don't know if you guys told you that, but yeah, so I'll be rebuilding that, which is totally fine. And like I said, I'll be rebuilding that road, coming off of that, so I'm really excited about the city, totally excited, really excited. Uh, this, I'm not quite sure what it's going to be it. It might be a car wash. I don't really know. Probably not. Or a, I'm thinking of a, like, more of a, like, city works department where they have, like, all the construction trucks and all that stuff. And another thing, here's my uh, Miller Park. I haven't done anything to it. And I will not do anything to it. I'm just going to tell you that right now. And you're probably like, what? What do you mean it's not going to do anything to it? Uh, most likely this thing will be coming down. And I will be rebuilding it for the second time because uh, I messed up on so much stuff. And plus, all these base plates in here are different colors. I like to keep them all the same color instead of buying all those bricks. So I'd be better off just buying these big gray base plates, which are really expensive. So I don't know what I'm going to do quite yet. But yeah, otherwise, it's going to be about the same. It's going to look about the same, but it's just going to hopefully be a lot nicer. So I'm planning on taking that down. I'm kind of excited, kind of not excited because all my work. But don't care. Just hopefully it'll look better. Um, so yeah, um, 
it's my city road. I'm really happy with how that turned out, especially with the crosswalks. I don't know why, but just the way it worked out, I just had one stud missing right there. So I made them all do that, except for somehow this one. I don't know how that happened, but whatever. And uh, I kind of ran out of these, and then till tonight, the pick a brick wall, I went to the Lego store for the Pink Flamingo Monthly Model Build. Uh, by the time I uploaded this, this is probably um, a few days after this, but uh, yeah, so when I went to the Lego store, uh, they had uh, all the pieces out on the wall, and somebody must have asked them for these pieces. I didn't hear them ask them or anything, but I, all of a sudden I turn around and they're on the counter. I'm like, ooh, I need those. So I uh, grabbed a handful of those. So hopefully I'll be good. I'll make parking lanes with those maybe, and probably more crosswalks if I needed them. I don't even think I need them anymore now that I think of it. But yeah. So I don't think that road's going to run through because the uh, water back there kind of want to have like a boat thing right there. Um, so yeah, I'm excited. And I also, not to totally change the subject, but my baseball stadium like I was talking about before, I will make a separate video of like the whole thing. Um, but then I might, might be for a few weeks or so. So yeah, this is coming along really well. I'm really, really excited about this. This is definitely way different than you guys seen it last time. I thought I kind of updated you guys on this a while ago, but I must have forgot about the city updates and stuff. I think this is only like city update five or four. I think it's pretty sure it's five, but whatever. I mean, yeah. So like I said, hopefully I'll be ordering pieces for those. So I'll have like, and I only have white grills. I don't have any gray grills. So hopefully I'll be like putting that like every other one. So these are not all grills. Like I did this one here. I'll show you this. I had the white one, so I just put them all there. I think that looks really stupid. Um, so I'll probably just do like uh, every other one. That's still kind of dumb, but at least you got some sewage. Like take these, take this one and this one out, and just keep the one one there, one there, and maybe the one in the middle. Might even take the one in the middle out too. But yeah, otherwise I need to make some more traffic lights. So those are just from sets, those corners. So this, the fire hydrant fell off of it. It goes to that set. That is for the Lego City Ambulance, which probably will not work because I need about these size corners. So, yeah, this is coming along great. I am so, so pumped. I cannot wish wait to keep building. As I said, I just got pick a brick. Hopefully, I'll be building this gas station. And I'll definitely keep you guys posted more than before because um, city updates are always really fun to make and everyone seems to enjoy them. Also, um... Yeah, so, because with all the pieces I got, I will hopefully be able to build at least some of this gas station. I have a couple pumps. Um, I have a pump from that uh, big semi over there. I could also get that Octane, the other one, the newest one that came out, but I don't know. Because I don't think that semi is going to fit there. I'll have to maybe get that little one or modify that one, which I highly doubt I won't do. I'll probably just buy the other one. So yeah, uh, I don't know what's going to go there. In that corner, I might put another base plate there if I have room. But I'm not quite sure. And then I think that's it. I don't really think I have any other great news. Except for uh, this road. I can just take you on a little tour around my city. So yeah. And then it goes down there. So yeah. It's a Lego City update. And thank you for watching.